Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Depending on the time and location you are tuned to our channel, thanks a lot for the visit. Ha, ah, about you AG update now. Everywhere is silent. But Madam Jennifer decided to speak again. You know, one thing about I like about the lady, about Madam Jennifer, is that she 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 speaks anything that comes to her mind. And for what she speaks, you have the mind of what is going on in UAG. So just listen to her. See her on the other side. The NGO you people are calling now. Uh -huh. If all of them join finish, if you reach to move out, everybody will go to withdraw himself. Now today with NGOs, everybody no go like to show in face. Make them no remove them or make them no stop. Make them no deny them payment. All these people now from uh, Tepecom and uh, Tiob Tiobato. Uh, we will be serious as the tether now. You know when we start down. Uh, only me, my very self, with my group, we wait for first year to, to petition all these guys and are calling NGO to come. Out of more than 6,000, I'll be 7,000 NGOs. It was only seven that came out. You <clears throat> uh, people are talking about NGOs, and I never know anything. Brother, you people should relax. This money will be paid. The money will be paid. Apostle Ken is not deceiving anybody. This grant, this type of grant, have never been paid in this Nigeria. As big as this nation, all the other 36 states, people subscribe in it, which means it's the whole nation. The one that we have been hearing people doing is empowerment. Palliative and empowerment is not grant. But this grant that I'm giving this voice note to the platform here. But this grant that is being paid for the whole federation, this is the first time this type of a thing is being done. They are doing this type of a thing. A lot of documents, this type of document have not come in that they are signing. The one they make mistake, they will go back and correct it and bring it back. And another thing is that what I found out in this grant is that many people that on this government committee they don't want to make mistake tomorrow if they make mistake they lose their job you will not come and feed their family your masses will not come and feed their family me and they like to tell people the truth if you like take it if you like tell them that not them them it is your business but those that know the truth will know it and they want to be very careful so that after they disburse this money give a go ahead they disburse the money they will not come and find out some errors. They will pick all of them straight to Kujay. Go keep them there. By that time, masses have collected their money and, and, and travel out, collect their money, go they do their business, enter their house, lock door. Because government will say, go and do. And they will be watching you. If they will see any little mistake or error that you will make in what they ask you to do, they will take it and rope you inside. They know very well. Those people in higher powers, they know this committee is them and these grand people that they have that they have stretched, stretched out to handle this matter. They know exactly this everything. Apostle Ken said, want to be careful too. We go this once money finish, we enter serious problem. We everybody don't enter their house with, with husband and wife and children. Everybody will enter their house with their family to go they they would enjoy the money. Why you you day inside paper? I know how everything, a lot of things is going on. That's why I, I kept quiet. It seems as if they don't bribe me. I follow chop money. I chop masses money. Just as you people are saying, during that 500 naira for Sabaka, I don't eat. They don't, I don't saw in my hand. That's what some people are private chatting me. I look at them. I say, it's not their fault because your wife, you know, release your wife to come or your husband to come and suffer all these things that we are suffering here. It's not their fault. And have it been that all the women are paying us in Abuja here, we that are here, trying to put eye down to watch what is going on. Nobody is paying us, so they believe now who for work who send you. But they forgot that if it is not we that is in Abuja here, and those of us who are agitating for this thing, we will not reach this level we are. So those who want to go for action, good and fine. If you go the action, they do well. They may go there anything. I, I pray they will not encounter any problem. God will guide them safely. 
But all I know, all these ones, and even though you meet to Nundu, he will tell you that I have sent people to do this thing and they are on it. Finish. It is a, it, do you think that we that is in Abuja here, we are fools? Maybe somebody, me, where they carry phone like this, I go naked everything, koro, koro, front and back. Do you think that as I keep quiet, that, I, that there's something, I don't see anything make me keep quiet? As I want to go, you people should come as a rock. If you don't know road, you don't know reach. If you don't reach any bus stop in Abuja, I go carry on and go as a koro. I go carry on and go as a rock and I go go see, see to Numbu. I go direct to Numbu and I go go Lagos because sometimes it's a day deal. And I will go. No way where I don't know for Lagos. I spent 31 years in Lagos there, so no place where I don't know. So you people, all these things, is, is it even necessary now? There's the grant supposed to be paid in December, they know pay January, no pay. It's even months and days we go to the account. Let us just pray that when as they have finished a lot of things now, let God even touch them. So that they will release the money and pay people. That's all. Who do gra gra pass me? Who do petition pass me? Who do protest pass Jennifer? I just pile down. As I pile down, it just be like say I don't know what I'm doing, but I I'm seeing how everything is going. You get as you go make noise rich, self disturb them rich. They go just pick you, go keep you one place. My family go come, they cook cook food, they carry, give you, distract your wife or your husband that's supposed to concentrate to put food on the table. They come, they distract them, they run up and down. You people don't even know it. It's in Nigeria, be in a place where people they do anyhow now. We bandit, Boko Haram full everywhere. Don't turn to voice note. Good night, man. Good night, Abeg. NGOs will not position Kenwa Kama. They will not because they have duped their masses. Some of them have bought cars, bill houses. I know so many of them. It's for their masses to kill like six, seven NGOs. Then they will now rise up. Other NGO will be afraid to die. Then they will position Kenwa Kama and the government. And they will find out to know the truth outside of this. Please, masses arise. Operation, look for your NGO. Beat them. If you hold one, beat, break leg. Some break hands. Some don't kill. Some break their hands. Then have secures, have carried security everywhere. So NGOs will not have the money to pay for the security. So if we want to get the truth, if we want the NGOs to rise up to protest, to do all these things, is oppression. Kill your angel, beat him, uh, remove his two eyes. If you can remove, <laughs> if you can remove their eyes, remove it. <laughs> Operation kill, kill your angel, beat them. Oh, remove your eyes, break their legs and their hands. If you see their children, break their legs and their hands. Because NGOs are still enjoying registering people, collecting one one thousand naira to register people. Is it not wickedness? If they were using their money to travel, do it, register their NGO, do this, by this time they could have rise up. But because they were collecting from bundle heads and they are making enough, some of them have opened business company through the masses money. So they don't have any time there in some of their business. Even when they say they should support for a press conference, they don't want to support. They don't have time because it's none of their business. It was not their money. So the masses, if we want this money to enter, if we want to know the truth, Operation, hold your NGO, beat them, beat them, beat them. If you can kill, kill. If you can beat them, I mean, beat them. Block their eyes or break their legs, break their hands. If two, if six to seven NGOs hear what is happening to others, they will call for emergency meeting. They will call for emergency meeting and position Kenwa Kama because they don't want to die again. This is the only solution. Masses, please, you people should rise. These lies upon lies upon lies upon lies is too much. Tomorrow they said uh, is due. Next tomorrow they said uh, is uh, 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 Mr. Dawood that uh, positioned them. Next they say government NGO. Next they say it was a uh, Madam Blessing. Next it was.